Hey everyone, Jen and Adam here. And today we thought we would switch it up and do something a little bit different and talk about our pollinators on the farm. We're going to talk about some of our wildflower installations that we put in, as well as some of our cultivated flowers that really attracts and supports our pollinator habitat here on the farm. And even though we do cultivate a lot of flowers for production, you know, a lot of these fields will leave in place. So these zinnias, for instance, will leave in place after they bloom. They're a favorite for the monarch population as Iowa is a way station for the monarch migration. As they make their way down to Mexico, they make a stop here at our farm and forage off of our zinnias that we leave in place. It's fun cutting our dahlias and finding sleepy little bees asleep inside of their petals. The dahlias are one where the bees love to take a nap in them. Our sunflower field installations have played a huge role in our pollinators here on the farm. They're another one like the lavender where you can literally hear the bees buzzing in the field. It's incredible. And of course, it's an amazing place to take some awesome pictures. Or a maze for a furry friend. Our bees especially love foraging on our lavender. We have a local beekeeper who keeps bees on our property and it's fun for us to be able to have her harvest out the honey and we can share this honey that's infused with our lavender. The lavender, when it is in full bloom, the entire field is just thundering with bee buzz. It is absolutely crazy. one of our wildflower installations. This is Cosmos and they look absolutely stunning, like they're dancing in the wind. Growing milkweed is extremely important. We find a lot of monarch caterpillars on our milkweed plants, and we've found that it's important to spread seed as much as possible and grow as much milkweed as we possibly can. We hope you all enjoyed today's video showing you some of our pollinator habitat and some of our pollinators here on the farm. If you enjoyed today's video, please like and subscribe. And as always, thanks for joining and thanks for supporting the pollinators.